Hello and welcome to our channel Wiki Procedure Info. Today we will see how to apply for National Children Fund in Meghalaya. The link which I am highlighting right now, you will find this link in the description box of this video. You can click on the link to reach this page. Once you reach this page, you can select your suitable language from this select language tab, which you can find on the top left corner of this page. In this page, we have gathered all the relevant informations and instructions about this procedure. You can scroll down and see. Here you can find office locations and contacts, eligibility, validity and many other informations. Before sit for online application or other way of application, you will have to arrange these documents which are completed application form. Here you can find the link for the application form. Photo ID proof of your child, address proof of your child. You can show Aadhaar PAN, voter ID, driving license, any of them. Copy of PAN, uh, PAN card of board members of CCI, registration of CCI, copy of memorandum, of association of CCI, copy of constitution and bylaw certificate of CCI, operating bank account, audited statement of accounts, passport size photograph of the child, copy of the passbook of the child, recommendation of district, study and attendance certificate. After arranging these documents, you can go through the application procedure. Here, you can apply in person, apply online, apply through CAC Center. For online application, you can click on this link. If you click on this link, you will be taken to this page. This is National Children Fund portal. The application form will be given in the month of April, June and the last date for receiving application from child care institution will be 15 July every year. The National Children's Fund will open a portal which is this uh, portal you can see but this uh, portal do not have facility of online submission of that application you may submit the application by hand by post After that, it will be verified by the District Child Protection Officer. Scrutiny of application issue of the sanction order. Release of amount online to the beneficiary directory directly to the bank account through DBT. The scholarship amount should be fixed deposit after immediately uh, uh, the after the receipt. A copy of FD must be forwarded to NCF for record. So you must uh, follow for the scholarship. Follow these steps for the scholarship. Uh, that's all for this video. If you like this video, subscribe our channel for more procedure videos like this. Also, if you have any queries regarding this procedure, you can leave in the comment section. We will meet your queries as soon as possible. Thank you.